Okay, so I just wanted to go over a quick update on how things are going with uh, the programming of this game, uh, The Adventures of Smiley. Um, the main work I've done in the past month, I haven't had a lot of time to work on it, but I've, the time that I have had to work on it, um, I've spent on uh, trying to do some character development and solving the problem of uh, having the characters behave in an interesting way when the player comes by. So the two things that I added um, were a spider boss which is a bit more challenging than the original placeholder, and a uh, cannon enemy that, that shoots at you and tries to hit you with a cannonball. So we can start it up. And, um, oh yes, so I've started doing the development of this game on a, on a Mac, and one thing I've learned about the Mac is that it has a different set of MIDI drivers, apparently, as compared to a PC. Uh, the result is that my attempt at making the first level song sound like a rock song it kind of now sounds like that song from Mr. Rogers when the trains go by. Um, but whatever. We can fix that problem. Uh, here's the first uh, new enemy. There's these cannon guys. And they're actually a bit of a pain to dodge because they aim right at you. So if I don't move, they'll always hit you. You can even program it so that even if you're running, uh, they'll, they'll try to hit you, assuming you move at a constant speed. Um, and What's interesting is that if you have a cannon which can fire a projectile, like a given uh, muzzle velocity, I guess you call it, there's actually two uh, distinct angles they can fire at to hit the same point. And these cannons pick that um, one of those points at random and uh, either fire directly at you or take a, a higher path uh, to try to mix you up. Um, I also stole a sound clip from a Star Trek movie for the death scene. So, lawsuit pending. Um, so that's those guys. And the next thing is the, the boss. So we can see him here. He looks a bit more dramatic and uh, he's a bit more challenging to, uh, to attack even though he makes some ridiculous noises right now. Um, same old guy. So the, the interesting thing now is that uh, if he hits you with one of these projectiles, you get caught in this web and he'll charge and gobble you up. Um, and he has a bit, uh, very repetitive, but a bit more interesting behavior than just walking back and forth. Um, so I really have to change that sound. And uh, he's still fairly uh, fairly easy to defeat though. Uh, so that's what I'm, kind of what I'm working on now, the character development and going to get a bit more um, interesting artwork hopefully for the game. And that's about it, so um, until next time, we'll see you.